Hi everyone, my name is Matthias. In this video I will show you how I change the strings on my acoustic guitar. Okay, the first thing what we're gonna do is um, take off the old strings and for this we're gonna use um, a Planet Waves string cutter. This is a great tool and uh, you can use to take off the strings as well. So, and I will change the strings one by one. So this, with this tool, it will be a little bit faster. So I highly recommend to get, to, to buy one of these because, because changing the strings, it's, it's not the best thing to do as a guitarist. So one by one. After that, in this part, I also have to use a tool because, because these things stuck so hard. Um, yeah, so this is why I have to use this tool. Maybe you don't have to be care. Okay, low E string. I'm using an Alixir strings. Um, it's not a paid review, but uh, I love these strings and this is why I thought I will show it to you guys. So, low E string. Great. After I usually hold the guitar like this, you should find the hole. Okay. I need... Yeah, and this part is, is really important because usually I break the strings like this. So I didn't do anything, just break uh, the strings. After I cut it off, yeah, with this tool, and after that, I've got only one thing to do. Low E string down. I tune the guitar a little bit. Let's continue with the with the A string. Take it off. Yeah. I need a tool for this part. So, like this way, so yeah, gotta close up, because of this part, we don't have to worry about this string anymore, cut off. Yeah, it's a little bit, a little bit hard to do it this way because I cannot see what I'm doing. So tune the guitar after I change the strings. Okay. 
D string. Yeah, this is the D. Make sure it's it's correctly in. Maybe not this is the best tool to take off uh, these things from here, but uh, actually you can you can use uh, the string cutter as well with this part. Maybe you can see. So with this part, you can you can do the same, but uh, but this is this is a really old uh, string cutter. And um, this is why it's it's not works anymore. This is why I have to use another tool. So yeah, this this is the G string. Okay. So when you start this this side, I mean from the G string, it will be on the opposite side. When you break the strings, make sure that you do it in a correct way. And you have to break it like this on the from the G string, because when you tune it up, it will goes this way. So yeah, and I forget to cut the strings. Mm -hmm. B string. Now I would like to show you what exactly I'm doing with the strings when I when I break it. Yeah. Can you see this? This is what I'm this is what I'm doing with the string because it will stay there. Okay, one more string. Yeah, and when you finish, you should stretch the strings a little bit. Yeah, you, sh you should repeat this process a few times after grab a tuner. I'm using great application and track tuner, this one. When you change the string, it's not that easy to tune the guitar because it's changing uh, when you're stretching the strings. So, but it's not that hard when you change the nylon strings guitar. That, that's the worst. I mean, from the tuning perspective. Good to go.